Hey there, our Pat Seiko here, front of house engineer for Chris Stapleton. How y'all doing today? I'm just gonna point out some of the SE mics that we've been using out on the road and have had great success with. I need more of me and my monitor now. We've had a wonderful time using the ubiquitous V7. Great mic, can handle the SPL that our uh, guy likes to put out. Good rejection with feedback, he's all on wedges, so that's a huge consideration for us. It's been magnificent, um, looks stylish, and uh, we've had great success, great success with it. <laughs> and we have a good time and laughs out here on the Stapleton Tour all year long. <laughs> we like this mic so much, we actually take it to all the award shows that Chris performs at, all the TV shows. We always have a pair of them with us because we find it to work really well. Uh, other engineers in the TV world and the award show world, they seem to be totally fine with it and we uh, hope to keep using them. Next, hi, I'm Arpad Seiko. You might remember me from such tours as <laughs> I've just started using the uh, SEV Beats. Uh, I've been chasing Tom mics for a good while now and uh, I think the V Beats are something that I'm gonna be uh, well, I plan on using them for the uh, duration at this point. Uh, I've only had a chance to use them about four times now in full concert situation, full shows, and really dig where they're at. Uh, plenty of low end on them. Uh, Derek, our drummer, he's got a very open sound to his kit, uh, very mid-rangey sounding toms, and the uh, V beats really seem to pick that up really well and I can add a bunch of thunderous low end to it if needed, and I don't seem to get the same feedback issues that I was getting with certain other mics. So yeah, the V Beats are uh, working out for us great out here. We also got a V Kick on our kick drum, obviously. Hi, this is uh, Johnny B, our monitor engineer. He's gonna talk to you more about the use of the V Kick. Yeah. Well, I use the V Kick for basically all sub applications. Um, when there's not enough feel on stage, I'll kick them into the side fills and subs to really thump the deck when there's lack of thump, but, you know. <laughs> well, not from you, just like Red Rocks, case in point. Right. You'd think that place would be more vibrant, but it's deader than, you know, I can't really say that, can I? Um, there's some places where the low end is just lost on stage. I mean, not to, because of front out, it's just the phys physics, basically. Physics. So I use that kick drum to really thump the deck when I need the physics. <laughs> when you need the physics to thump it. When I need the physics yeah. to thump it. There you go. There no you slop, go. lots of thump. Yay, V-Kick. Hi there. I'm Arpad Seiko. You might remember me from such videos as drum kit mics and maybe vocal mics. Here I am to talk to you about another SE product we have out on stage, Guitar F. The Guitar F. Now, we are using it on a bass rig which just shows the versatility of these products. And uh, I needed to put this uh, shield on here because the mic on the uh, cabinet was picking up way too much of our drummer. And this has helped. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs>